Let's go on a tour of the lower level of the Riverside Public Library. This area of the library has been virtually unchanged since the renovation and addition in 1986. Our young patrons use the lower level of the library to do everything from socialize, use technology, work on homework. In fact, this area of the library is the busiest in the entire library. However, this space was designed to hold stacks of adult books, making it inside out from its current purpose. Right now, books are along the perimeter, causing blind spots in the corners and pushing students of all different ages into one space. Toddlers to teens are on top of each other in the open atrium space, causing all sound from after school to story time play to go all the way upstairs at maximum volume. And the space is showing its age. It doesn't match the beauty of the rest of the historic building. The proposed renovation addresses all of these issues. A larger multi-purpose room for programming and story times will be in this space. With added storage and neutral decor, it will be engaging for all ages. A brand new teen room will house the young adult collection and give designated space to our older students. With upgrades in technology for recreation and cooperative learning, it will be a fantastic new location. Our elementary spaces will be refreshed with new furniture and decor, plus appropriate ample seating for after school study. The almost completed new early learner section gives a sneak peek of what's in store. This renovation was paid for through fundraising and gifts. Additionally, the public meeting room hosts library programs, Girl Scout meetings, and adult clubs, and more. The proposed renovation calls for improved technology, seating, and enlarging the space with a room divider to allow concurrent meetings. The library is a hub of our community, and the lower level is a learning destination for our youngest patrons. Thank you so much for coming on this virtual tour. More information about the proposed renovation and referendum can be found on a bulletin board inside the library or on our website, riversidelibrary.org.